chat about the fallacy that is called avoiding the issue. This is Shepard, and this is one that I face frequently when I'm discussing the issue of taxation with people in terms of morality. And so I will make the the comment that it seems to me that taxation is theft. Uh, if we define theft as taking someone from someone else uh, non-voluntarily, requiring that they give it to you without having made an agreement or something like that. And then uh, a response I will often get will be, well, yeah, but without taxes, how would we have a military? How would we have roads? You have to have taxes. After all, in the Bible, Romans 13, it says, given to Caesar. Well, these are all examples of someone that is avoiding the issue. The issue that I was bringing up in the discussion was taxation is immoral. There was not a a discussion of degree or uh, practicality, pragmatism. It was just saying, is this action moral or immoral? And then to talk about, well, if we didn't do this action, then we wouldn't have this thing. That's completely changing the subject. That is avoiding the issue. The issue is, is it okay to take things against from people uh, against their will, you know, without their permission, to force them to give it to you under the threat of doing something bad to them later? And that is the discussion at hand. Whether or not I am correct is not, not relevant. That is the issue. So, when you are chatting with someone, please make sure you do not let them get away with avoiding the issue. Let them say their thing and then bring them back to the real issue at hand.